message now. Oye, who care the propaganda? Fuck yeah, you did. Let's go a little bigger, see? Just saw those coming mierdas and putting up another fucking Anton statue in El Presidente Square. I swear, it's the only way that guy can get her. He's as good as gone, Talia. Silvio, motherfucker. Soy el que está sacando el underground de abajo al piso Digo lo que me da la gana, si 
pedir permiso Yo soy de corazón valiente al igual que Mel Gibson El único que saca la cara por mi país Me siento el elegido como Neo en la matriz Creo que si sigo así tan enfocado Me van a tener que dar un Grammy y traérmelo hasta Mariana Ando vuelto todo loco, no tengo comparación Haciendo revolución dentro de la revolución Pueden llevarse el micro y formatearme la lacto Pero nunca de comenzar me Dahlia, I'm at the statue. Bullets are going to cut it. I'm gonna need to blow it up somehow. Guess you gotta get creative, Gideon. See.
Dahlia, I'm at the statue. Bullets are going to cut it. I'm gonna need to blow it up somehow. Guess you gotta get creative, Gideon. See. Si.
ignition. Don't wreck this one, okay? Maximus Matanzas is fucking dead. Radio Libertad is dead. We were the mouth of the revolution. Mouth. Mouth. And you know what's even worse? This bottle is empty. How fucked up is that? You and me got a date with some cervezas. And then those cervezas is, 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 is friends and family and cousins, every fucking cerveza on this whole stupid island. I have a plan. There's some soldiers here and they have booze, but they, they, they don't need it like, like, a, like a we do. <laughs> Liberate the cervezas, daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking get your liver ready. We're gonna put that little guy through the ringer. is now. You are a genius. Let's do this. Priorities way. Feeling it. Definitely feeling it. Danny, you hear that? Music! Come, Danny!
time. Go on, you little fucker. Let's dance. The fuck? Fuck you. Everybody dances. If Bicho is gonna dance, he's gonna dance to his own fucking music. Easy now. Can you play this? It will really cheer up my friend. Dale! Hey! you get up at like four in the morning and do push-ups. What? Yeah, a thousand. If you stop, her buddy Juan shaves your ass and spanks you. And if you puke, they make you do math. Me lleva la chingada fucking math? No way. No way, way. You're full of shit. You're lying. <laughs> Since when did you want to be a guerrilla? Never mind, forget it. Danny! <laughs> Kate? I, I can't look at our old graffiti. Now it's messed up. <laughs> That's Just it. Like That's every single one. Really? How, how many did you do? Like, at least a hundred. Drink. The bicho, my little chalupa. I think it's time for some real guerrilla shit. Follow me. Rock us that shit, bicho. Let's make Saguna fucking dance. <laughs> For libertad.
¿Cómo está? ¡Coño, sí! I'm going to remodel Maria's office. <laughs> Hang on. There's a password. Ay, pinga. Um, one, two, three, four. Wait, that worked? Let's get out of here. <laughs> it's not fair, man. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. <laughs> it isn't. What is it? You. I mean you. Look at you. Look at you. You want to do something, you go out there and do it. People see me, they think, fuck up. They see you, and it's, wow, the god of Yara. That is not what people see. Uh, bullshit, it is. No. Mm. They see this, and that's it. But I'm okay with that. Yeah, because you're a badass. You know, before Libertad, I had two best friends, just like you. Lito used to joke we were nothing but numbers to the rest of Yara. I was lucky orphan 13 at Esperanza School for the Lost. Then, Cadet 2683. And after that, Trafty 0418 to rebuild Castillo's paradise. When Lita died, she called me the lucky one. Like an idiot, I thought. Still just a number, Danny. And nobody. But I wasn't listening. She knew I still had a chance to be who I wanted to be. She was telling me not to waste it. To act. People see what they want to see. Not a number. Not a fucking gun. I'm a guerrilla. It's like you. I use this. And you. You use that, huh? Hmm. But I could be a cool fucking gun too. Bichos are crying mess, and Talia's just fucking chaos. I think it's time to face reality, Danny. Maximus Matanzas is too far gone. I'm going to head back to camp, talk to Talia. Don't give up on them yet, Clara. You're called, Danny. How's he going? 
It's time to go face to face. We hit Maria's rum factory, we fucked up her billboards, and the bitch didn't even bat a fake eyelash. Meanwhile, Maximus Matanzas is dead, and I'm still stuck in this swamp. We've spilled real blood, Danny, and Marquesa doesn't even have a scratch on her. Fuck this. I'm gonna call out her bullshit right to her face. Marquesa's putting on a PR event, some kind of tour for foreign journalists. If you can get us passes, I'll give her a one-on-one -on -one performance in front of the whole world. Force them to hear the truth. Let's fuck up Marquesa's show. Coming up to Maria's TV station. Anything you can tell me? Press passes? I won't ask. Look, Danny, they're holding one of our guerrillas inside. So free them if you can. I'll do my best. Gracias, Clara. Ah, of course! 
Italia. Keep it together, okay? You keep it together, Danny. Don't lose those passes. Meet me and Bicho in the Botanical Gardens parking lot and don't go in without us. Aquí. I'll keep this.
Here, you're a reporter now. Felicidades. Fuck yeah. This is Talia Benavides from Urban Garden. Coño, it's good enough. Take our stuff so we don't get shot. Let's change these clothes. Wait, aren't you... Silvio Balboa Garden City? Urban Garden? Can we move this along? Maria's waiting. Welcome, welcome, my beautiful foreign friend. for traveling so far to learn about Vivir, the Castillo administration's pride and joy. Let us begin. The architecture. Impressive. All right. A lot of money not going to the rest of your life. Today, I am honored and excited to share with you the miracle of Viviro, a revolutionary cancer treatment. Thirteen years ago, the brilliant biochemist, Dr. Edgar Reyes, discovered a compound unique to Yara that slows cancer cell growth. But it is Presidente Anton Castillo's full support that allows us to produce this all-natural drug. Come, witness a breakthrough of innovation, generosity, and true Yaren spirit. Follow me. Possible for the inside tour. You really make the reporter feel special. Anything for you, Nikolai. <laughs> it all starts with Nicotiana Yarana, our native tobacco plant grown in our western farmlands. Our tobacco is world famous for its unique flavor. Wondering what made it so unique, Dr. Reyes studied the plant's properties. And I don't mean he smoked a lot of cigars. <laughs> he found a compound that actually slows cancer cell division, practically to a halt. This way, my lovely people. Ready for the next part of our Viviro adventure? The Reyes found that natural tobacco crops produced a limited amount of the compound. So, President Anton commissioned Yara's best minds to work with Dr. Reyes to design an all-natural fertilizer, PG-240. Spread on, like a hairspray, it uses gene therapy and nutrients to boost production of the compound. If you look, this tobacco has large red leaves. This is from the fertilizer. Beautiful, no? Puro, organico, e exotico. No? Would anyone like to spray the plants? Come, press this button. It is so much fun. <laughs> Okay, I'll demonstrate. Okay. Mm. The fertilizer is working on the plant as we control. This is the beginning of the Viviro process. Using McKay to sidestep embargoes was considered quite controversial. Those critics only want to profit from cancer, from death. They see us as a threat, so they try to ruin us. This way, por favor. Okay, closer, closer. Get intimate. <laughs> I want you to hear me. refine and package the cancer-fighting tobacco compound called Yarantin. 
found only in yar and tobacco. Dr. Reyes thinks yar and tin is why our cigars are so smooth. <laughs> Delicious and beneficial, no? I smoke one cigar a week and it keeps me skinny and strong. It's true. <laughs> okay, that's the tour. Our interactive stations are now available for you to enjoy. When you are ready, join me by the gate in the outdoor lounge for a surprise guest. There are rumors that farmers exposed to PG-240 are actually developing cancer. Yes. Rumors spread by fools and believed by idiots. It's not true. Uh -huh. Essential to killing yarns. Stay with the group, por favor. Something wrong, senor. <laughs> I didn't think this could happen. I hear even more now than before. And this ends our tour. But before we go, a surprise. Meet Dr. Edgar Reyes, the pioneer behind Viviro. Dr. Reyes, thank you so much for making an appearance. Ah, muy bien. Okay, everyone. Enjoy the showroom and some of our finest Yaren Rome. This is a preview of other Viviro products we are developing. Chewables, nasal sprays, vaginal suppositories. It is a... Uh, I say it. Sneak peek. So peek. Peek away. <laughs> if you have questions, please email my assistant, Julio. <coughs> Come now, Dr. Reyes. We don't want to be late. Neither do we. Let's get in there. I told Vichu to leave our weapons back here. I hope you're ready to fuck shit up. What now? Take it as it comes. We got this. Stay on your toes.
the scientist. They just leave. Where are they? Get shooting. True Yarens, welcome. We have a special program for you today. Maria Puta Marquesa, Minister of Culture, Uncle Anton's personal whore. You're also director to the True Yarens Academy, no? Where you fry people's brains to make sure they play nice? Like you did to me, right, Maria? What? Mm, don't play dumb, bitch! Daria, put the gun down. She's not worth it. You... You attacked my home. You put your filth on my network. You have any idea the embarrassment I had to endure because of your disgusting performance? I have given everything I am to be here. You think you can take that away from me? My academy was built to save fake yarns like you and that muddy macho you spread your perversions with. But where is she? Does she not approve of you playing with guns? Fuck. Oh, yeah. Let's go, let's go! What happened? Get her the fuck out of here! Fuck. Hello? Maria's dead. <laughs> Fuck yeah. 